four candidates took to the podium to sell their vision to the electorate of the largest opposition party for the position of party president. Moderated by journalists Charles Mwanguhia and Joel Chibazo, the candidates were asked a raft of questions on internal party democracy, national unity and employment, regional relations and the general political debacles in Uganda. The first set of questions was on how the four candidates intend to deal with the glaring rift within FDC over strategy. We are not the first party to have differences in terms of uh, approaches. All parties worldwide have got tendencies. The only question is, do you have the capability amongst the leaders to manage those differences in fighting on different fronts? We are going to have one party, one strategy under my presidency. My, my role as president is to see that Najan Ankundi rally the infrastructure of FDC and its support base behind the people's government in its activities to do its work. But the president, one thing I have to deal with is not to be obvious to this regime. There were also questions on how the four, if elected, will work towards building a vibrant party. That as FDC, we cannot change this country alone. Therefore, we must build alliances with all other change agents in terms of institutions and individuals it is within our culture. We will continue to mobilize. We will mobilize both covertly and overtly to ensure that we do these kind of things that will be able to help us tackle the entrenched regime now in Kampala. Ladies and gentlemen, the role of the next party president is to implement the decision of NEC to rally Ugandans to reclaim their country. The candidates were also asked to comment on the contentious proposal to amend Article 102B of the Constitution, which has deeply polarized the country. We need to work on the numbers in Parliament and deny him 303 members of Parliament so he cannot amend, amend that Constitution. It's going to be our duty to go out there and continue mobilizing these people to stand up against those who choose to rape our constitution. We are going to do people-centered mobilization, rely on mobilization from the people. They also opined on the subjects of unemployment, democracy and revamping the national economy. More investment has got to be put in uh, agriculture in terms of uh, mechanization is going to advocate for the cutting down of uh, wasteful expenditure. My presidency also will advocate for reduction in the cost of administration. Robust cooperatives that will enhance the uh, negotiation power of our farmers so that money goes direct to them. Our first point is about a strong treasure of FDC. Without a strong treasure of FDC, you cannot sponsor or run our activities smoothly. After three months of campaigns across the country, the four candidates will wait for the verdict of the National Delegates Conference to choose the next party president. Oh.